Hi there, welcome back to session 4.8 Learn Excel from Karpakam. In this video, I am going to show you how to highlight alternate columns in Excel. Let's get started. When you want to highlight alternate columns in Excel, we need to use a function called as a mod and this function mod will be applied in conditional formatting. You might be asking what basically a mod function does in Excel. Mod function is a math and trigonometry function wherein it has got two argument. One is the number, the other one is the divisor. Let's say mod. What is the number? I'm not going to use a cell reference here. Rather than I'm going to use a column reference because of one simple reason. We are interested in highlighting the column, not the cell. So let's use column function. And the moment when you use a column function, it's not mandatory or it's not necessary that you have to specify the column number. Instead of that, you can just use it as a reference. It automatically goes and takes the column number from the respective column. Come on, what is the divisor? I'm interested to find out whether it can divide this column by two. And if it is true, return zero. Close the bracket. When I hit enter, you can see it has returned to zero, which means this particular column is a even column. The moment when I just drag it, you can see it's going to return a 0, 1. 1 is not an even column. Same way we can perform it for a row also. Mod row function reference we have done divisor let's say 2. Close the bracket. When you hit enter you can see 0. Again when you just drag it down you can see 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1. We will have the references here. In other term, what I can do is say, for example, mod open bracket. What is the number? So I'm going to use the same row reference here. I'm going to use the same row reference here. Comma, divide I by 2, close the bracket, equal to 0. This will return either true or false here. See, true, 0 is true. The moment when I just drag it down, you can see true, false, true, false. And same happens with a column function as well. When we want to do this, for the column function also, we can do true or false. So this is how a mod function performs. Now I'm going to use this mod function in conditional formatting. When I use it, this is how exactly the sheet looks like. Let's go and do it. Select the table first. Go to conditional formatting. Click on new rule. In the new rule, use a formula to determine which cell to format. Then in the rule description type mod open bracket, column reference, divided by 2, close the bracket, equal to 0. This is the formula we are using. So mod is the function. Within mod, we are using a column reference. So just go and look at A column, B, C, D and so on. When this A column is divided by 2 and it is written 0, then highlight it. That is what we are giving it. So click on format, choose whichever color you are interested in, click OK. Click OK and now you can see, now you can see the respective even columns are highlighted here. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks for joining. Stay tuned for more such videos. Good day.